Hey guys, how's it going? Tears back again with episode number two and match day number two of Pack Playoffs. Today we're taking on Scouting for FIFA, and I've made one change to my starting lineup. You'll be able to see I've actually swapped around Toivonen and Douglas Costa, so I've got an extra little bit of pace on the wing as opposed to having all of the pace up top. Because uh, Douglas Costa is my only player that has pace of more than like 77. Honestly, my pack luck has been so bad in this series so far. We're taking on Scouting for FIFA today in this one, as you'll be able to see in a second. He actually has a very, very decent team indeed. And talking of pace, look at his front line when it pops up. Katamarko, as you can see, he's got Molo, very, very high pace. Arnautovic, pace of 86. And Remy, pace of 91, question mark. So we definitely are going to be up against it. But as you can see, he doesn't have any centre-backs or wing-backs, any defenders whatsoever. But he does have a Rene Adler in goal. So even if we do get past his defensive line, it's still going to be very, very difficult to get the ball past Rene. So uh, we actually had to rely on Brad Guzan, our own keeper there, to keep us in the game. Decent cross, decent header. And again, Brad Guzan comes to the rescue. And here, wonderful double save. Fantastic. And then the clearance off the line. Keeps the ball, or keeps the score line at 0-0 as we head in at half-time. Now, unfortunately, the connection in this game wasn't the best. And uh, you'll be able to see from uh, Kieran's video, if you check the link in the description, there is a link to his channel, Scouting for FIFA. He actually did face cam for this, but you can see the stats at half-time. Possession 50-50. I could not sort anything out attacking wise whatsoever honestly this team they are just next level awful it's it's actually horrible to uh, to play with but I'm still going to you know I'm going to get stuck in I'm going to try my best as they say even if I do end up becoming some sort of whipping boy in the early stages until we can perhaps scrounge out some points and some packs judging by the uh, the rules which you can find of course in the description there is a list of the rules if you aren't particularly familiar with them to date but uh, again we rely on Brad Guzan to, uh, to keep us in the game at nil nil and uh, Kieran was probably raging quite hard at this point if you check his video and his face cam pretty sure there's going to be a little bit of rage going on there and again Brad Guzan comes to the rescue and it squirms out fortunately it went the right side of the post for me, the wrong side for Kieran. And we're going to break away ourselves here. Renato plays the ball over the top for Roberto Firmino. And I just could not get a shot away quick enough. And uh, the defenders are able to track back, get a cheeky foot in. And that is how the game is going to finish at 0-0. So we pick up our first point of pack playoffs so far. And uh, as you can see from the stats horrible performance I'm just having to concentrate on keeping possession to stop the opposition from just having 50 chances a game at the minute but we get the chance to open a 5,000 coin pack because of course we drew the game so hopefully we can get a decent pull because at the minute we only have central midfielders centre backs and goalkeepers I need some wide players or some strikers and in this pack we're actually going to pull as the spinny globe spins around pops up on screen a central defensive midfielder is Denisov we do get Conco to be fair we do get a right back but another centre mid as well with Belomo the silver player so my pack luck still isn't very good whatsoever but uh, I made a couple of changes to the first team of course we can now remove the uh, the make weight bronze players and put in all of the goal players we have now onto the bench. I think I'm going to continue with the 3-5-2 uh, formation for the next game. But I may put Conco at right mid to uh, to kind of give me that extra little bit of pace out wide. But this is how the table stands at the end of the second round of fixes. Scouting for FIFA is sat top after picking up a point against me. Joe Belline still sits second after losing his second game. Fuji Wheels and Funky Town all on two. And Luke Connor and myself and Mental Fishcake all on one. Now if you want to check out their videos and how they got on on match day two. Feel free to check the description. There will be links to all of their channels down there. And if you missed today's video earlier on on my channel. There will be a link as an annotation in the bottom left hand side of your screen. It was the first episode of another new series. The interactive road to division one. Where we try and get to division one on head to head. Playing with teams that you guys suggest. So jump in the comment section of that video. Have your feedback. Have your say in that series. And uh, hopefully that can go from strength to strength as well. But thank you very much for watching guys. Please do feel free to leave the video a like as always that would be greatly appreciated and I will see you tomorrow.